And welcome back, everybody. So, we don't... We didn't get anywhere with the church and the crypts. Maybe... Maybe Gerda... Will she tell me anything? I mean, we are making... Some stable progress, at least. We know that we need to get a date in the 1700s... Of a shot in Jaeger. I don't have anything to say to her right now. You do! Ask a goddammit, woman! You can ask this... I don't even know who this dude... Oh! This dude is gone. Hi. We're... That's curious. Oh. You forgot your tools there, buddy. Can I poke something in there? I don't think I need that. Can I jam a screwdriver into you? I think I can. That's probably a button lock for the library, isn't it? Or the closet? Nice closet. Oh ho 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 ho! Pretty sure Narnia started out like this and it didn't work out well for them. You should probably have just, you know, taken a nap. Uh. Uh. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Everything is locked up. I can't even get to the menu. One moment, please. Hey, welcome back, everybody. We should be, uh, good now. Someone's been using this passageway. Cool. Grace Nakamura. Gabriel Knight. You really want to go down there? You've got balls, Grace. I'll give you that. I think we all agree, folks. We need to bring back the FMV games. <laughs> this is... Oh. An emergency exit. <laughs> I guess that makes sense if you're fighting the legions of darkness. Except to get there, you have to remove a stone and jam a sharp pointy thing into it. How convenient. When the lord of the manor is slipping through the passageway to his amorous adventures, he can pick up a few flowers. <laughs> where, where am I? I think it'll be quicker to go back the way I came. The castle looks huge from here. They've got more rooms left to restore than I thought. The castle... I think it'll... But there has to be a purpose. The castle... The castle looks huge...
mean, I, I don't, I don't get the, the purpose of that. Let me guess. Gerda's bedroom. What a surprise. Wait, what? What? How the f- I, I, What? How did it lead to- That must be Wolfgang. Something to remember him by, I guess. Can I flip it? That must be. Why does Gabriel have a secret passage to. Can I grab her brush? Water brush. Water brush. <sighs> Whatever. There's like nothing in here. A picture. That's it. I can't go out that way. I don't want Gerda to know I'm in here. Well, the hell is the point of this room? I mean, you can't open up the... That must be... What's the fudge? Well, we've got an instant passage to Gerda's room if we need it. I have no idea. How did I even get in here? Get his clothes. Isn't she just as cute as a button? Hello, Key. Schottenjaeger Library Key. That's wiggling. Wouldn't it make more sense to keep that open since we're we're gonna be leaving, going to the I can't go out I think she's gonna know you're here when So Oh, I get it. That's where we came in at. I gotcha. Alright. Let's uh let's shot in this Jaeger up. It's locked. Well no crap it's locked. That's why you're gonna use this on it. Ha ha ha! Oh, God. Well, time to get reading. Uh... Biographies. Looks like they're mostly about Germans. Biography. Oh, boy. Books on the occult. Here we go. Vampires. Witchcraft. Ghosts. Asian spirits. Hmm. Lycanthropes. Uh-oh. How did you get in here? <laughs> oh, hi. How did you unlock the door? <laughs> uh oh. Oh, I see. All right. 
Look, let's just drop all the pretense, okay? Obviously, I found the passageway. I know what's been going on in this little Alpinian love nest, and really, I couldn't care less. If you want to screw around with your employer, that's none of my business. But what I won't put up with is just assisting the Schottenjäger crap. I gave up school to work on this stuff because I thought it was important. I'm doing the research that Gabriel wanted, and so help me, I'm going to be doing more than just research this time around. And I'm going to just sit around and wait for him to call and give me permission. And if you don't like it, it's just too damn bad! Oh my god. Okay. Fine. You do the damn research. What? What? <laughs> damn it. She's got a temper. <laughs> this is so... I love this so much. This is great. Okay. Uh, letter to Ludwig. 4th of March, 1864. To King Ludwig II, most gracious ruler of all Bavaria, I beg your forgiveness for my forthrightness in this letter, but I fear terribly for your majesty's safety and thus have no time for subtlety. I have heard that the one they call the Black Wolf is close to your highness. I have been investigating this man for reasons I cannot name at present, and I have learned that he is extremely dangerous and can only have the most dire of motives at heart in anything he pursues. I beg your highness only this. Please do not see this man alone, nor even with your servants, only to guard you. I promise you, all will be made clear very shortly when my investigation is complete. For now, only keep yourself safe. Your most grateful servant, Christian von Ritter, Schloss Ritter, Rittersburg, Bavaria. That's... Fourth of May. I have heard that the one they... Fourth of May, 1864. Quite important. Chapter 3. Lycanthropy. The Ways of the Wolf. There are two categories of werewolf cases, false or lycanthropic disorder cases and genuine werewolf cases. Lycanthropic disorder. Lycanthropic disorder is a mental condition in which the subject, called a lycanthrope, believes that he or she is a werewolf. The subject does not actually change shape, but is nevertheless capable of being as dangerous as an actual werewolf. Most cases of supposed werewolfry are really the work of lycanthropic disorder victims, man to beast. In real werewolves, a physical change to wolf form does occur. The change can be voluntary, at will, or can be forced by certain cycles of the moon and certain sounds, such as howling. Oops. Yep. Reading time. Werewolves and immortality. Werewolves are immune from aging and from most physical diseases due to the constant regeneration of their physical tissue. They can therefore be virtually immortal. However, they can be killed by any wound that destroys the heart or the brain, or any form of death that causes brain or heart damage, such as hanging or other oxygen deprivation methods. The mind of a werewolf. Though primarily a true wolf while in wolf form, there is some proof that the werewolf retains enough knowledge to assist his killing. Recognition of victims, evasion of traps, and human cunning have all been seen on werewolf cases. Becoming a werewolf. There are several ways to become a werewolf. They include being given the power of shape-shifting through sorcery, being cursed by someone whom you have wronged in some way, called the Lyconia Curse, being bitten by a werewolf, and being born to a werewolf. In each case, the blood of the subject becomes tainted or cursed. Damnation. A person who becomes a werewolf against his will, birth, curse, or bite, is not completely damned until he tastes of human blood. Once he does, his soul is eternally damned and nothing may redeem him. Even without tasting of human blood, however, as long as the taint lays upon the immortal soul, it cannot enter into heaven and will remain chained to the mortal plane upon death. Werewolf Packs Like real wolves, 
Werewolves can live alone for many years, yet the instinct for a pack often leads them away from their secretive lifestyles into revealing their nature to a priest or close associate or converting another to a werewolf free for companionship. This is when the otherwise cagey werewolf opens himself to detection. Werewolf packs cause immense destruction. A pack consists of one werewolf who became a werewolf through sorcery, birth, or curse. In other words, his is the original tainted blood. This werewolf is called the alpha werewolf. The remaining werewolves in the pack are called beta werewolves because they became werewolves through the bite of the alpha and carry the alpha's tainted blood. Alpha and Beta Werewolves The relationship between Alpha and Beta Werewolves is a complex one. Once a subject is bitten by a werewolf, his or her life and death are doomed to the werewolf curse. The victim does, however, have some hope. As long as they themselves do not taste of human blood, the curse is reversible. If the Alpha Werewolf is killed through some action of the Beta, the Beta's curse is broken. It is important to note that whether the beta werewolf was bitten by the alpha werewolf himself or by another beta, it is the alpha who must be destroyed, the source of the original tainted blood. It is also an interesting note that since betas and alphas share the same common blood, an alpha cannot physically harm a beta of his own bloodline by his own hand without inflicting the same injury upon himself. However, if a beta is harmed or killed by another, it does not affect the alpha. So, who wants to make a bet that Gabriel's going to turn into a wolf? <laughs> Symptoms of Werewolfry When hunting for a werewolf, it is important to remember that your biggest clues will come through your suspect's personalities. Becoming a werewolf is not transparent, no matter how the victim tries to hide it. The tainted subhuman blood greatly alters the subject's own mind and personality, even physical appearance. Therefore... Look for symptoms in your human suspects that include increasing violence, increasing aggression, unprovoked rages, insomnia, restlessness, and other bizarre behavior. Unfortunately, over time, these symptoms can be brought under control, so do not rely upon them exclusively. A good example of this comes from a case reported by the ancient priesthood society Manos del Sol of Brazil. A rash of werewolf killings there was tracked to a high-ranking officer in the army. The society became aware of the man mainly through rumors of his violent behavior and changed personality. The case was successfully resolved with a man's capture. Manos del Sol? Men of the Sun? I wonder if they're like Schattenjägers, only Brazilian. <laughs> well, I think that wraps up. What? No. Yeah, play. Thank you. I know it's a lot of listening and reading here, but we have a uh, we have a lot of really good leads. The Journal of Victor Ritter. Cool. Time to give that a little glance. Seventeen twenty to seventeen fifty three. Numerous deaths at the hands of a marauding wolf being recorded in a neighboring county, I set out to see if I could determine the cause. There had been rumors of a werewolf, and the dark signs did indeed seem to be present. The deaths had all occurred within a 40-kilometer range of woods, and at the heart was the village of Alfeng. My assistant and I set a trap a short distance from the village. Though the beast had shown a propensity for human flesh, livestock had also been taken. It was a newling lamb we loosed in the thicket as a lure. We awaited downwind. For two nights, the lamb bleated to no purpose, and once we had to fend off a hungry fox. But at last, the beast himself took the bait. I might have missed him. The night was so dark, and the wolf himself was black. But my assistant saw the light of his eyes, and I heard the lamb's cries turn fearful. 
He had the poor dumb lamb by the throat when we sprang. He was swift and might have escaped, but his fatal mistake was to attack rather than run. My dagger struck through his chest and into his right lung. As I had agreed, we bound the wolf and tied shut its jaws. We brought it home to Rittersburg, still breathing, and turned it over to the magistrate. I pray for the man's unfortunate soul. May the law be swift and merciful. God be praised for aiding his servant. From his hand came the strength and wisdom to end the killing. Victor Ritter, Schottenegger, 20 April 1750. Is there anything else there? I wonder if Christian Ritter's journal is here. Christian Ritter, born 10 January 1820, ordained a Schottenjäger, died 4 March 1864. The 4th of March. That's the date on the letter. I'm not sure what other case books would be relevant. There's nothing else on werewolves in Looks like biographies here. I wonder if there's anything on... Yes, Ludwig. Konig von Bayern. Konig Ludwig. Sein Leben und sein Sieht. Die letzten Tage des Konig Ludwig II. Hmm. German. That's not much help. Looks like biographies. I do have to laugh that at least all of their journals and everything are in English. That's that's very convenient. I'm not sure. I suppose in the next Blake Backlash book, good old Fujitsu will be replaced by Hildegard. Oh, she's so jealous. Hard at work, Knight. Oh. Who should I call? I'm not quite ready to write the big hero yet. Oh. Okay. Well, let us... Let us get our, our court cases. Oh, actually, let us save the game and call it. So, as always, folks, thank you very much for watching. Tune in to the next episode of Gabriel Knight, Le Beast Within. Thanks for watching, everybody.